Hey, what's going on guys? Clutch here. Welcome back to, well, Hazard County right now. But we are actually on our way back to County Line. Uh, we've got to go help out Pa for a bit as well. I heard there's a new dealership in the county. And I really want to go check that out. Oh, I really want to go check that out for sure. We've got, uh, I want to spend some cash on a new tractor. I really want to buy a new tractor. I've been dying to buy a, something a little bit, you know, crazy because we've making so much money. So, um, yeah, we're going to head to County Line. we got to go figure out what's going on. Uh, pick up new tractor. I'm going to go stop at the logistics center, do a bit of work there first. And, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Oh, someone's busy working in the field right there. Look at those guys out there working away. Cool. Anyways, we'll get, to, get going, guys, and I'll see you in a bit. Pitter-patter. Clutch Simulations. All right, guys, we're back on County Line. Thanks for joining me today. Oh, man. So we were down here. We had to go visit Paul for a bit, and I wanted to check up on how things are going down here. Not to mention our logistics center, uh, making sure that was good. Now, you know what? I had an idea. While I'm here, with all this money that we've been making off, uh, well, our, our certain little business adventures lately, I thought that uh, it might be a good time to maybe pick up a new tractor. Yeah, I think it's time we, we bought something with a little bit of money. So I've got, well, we've got a uh, Peterbilt, and I've got one of our low loader trailers from the logistics center as well. And we're heading down south to, well, one of the dealerships on 10, on the, uh, on the county here. Let's see what we can pick up. Let's jump inside. I love this truck. This truck is awesome. <laughs> oh, man. I almost want to take this thing all the way back to uh, to Hazard County with me. What do you guys think? Think this would be out good out there? This would be a nice truck to have there, I think. This ain't bad. Yeah, we're heading way down south here. All the way down to the very end, I believe. We got a new John Deere dealership that opened up down here. I need to go check that out. See if they uh, can get any good prices for me. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think we'll find something we can use. I don't know what we should go with exactly. I want something big. We've got the money. So I'm not quite sure yet what I should go with. We I mean, we've got the cash to buy something that's worthwhile. So we'll see this dealership if they got any good prices. And uh, maybe we can find something that's useful. I don't know. I want something, something big and meepy. That's for sure. Let's go check it out. Oh, sweet. Look at this. Oh, this, was, oh, this wasn't here last time I was down here. This looks fantastic. Look at all the John Deere's. Holy perfect. This is going to be the perfect place to buy something. Let's uh, let's go take a look see here. Let's see what we got. Oh, it looks like they must have just built this. It's not even fully built yet. This is perfect, though. All right, pull on in. Let's go see if anybody's in the office there. Um, ooh, look at this. Oh, man. Oh, man. They got so much equipment here. I hope I can get a decent deal on something. Let's, uh, I'm just going to pull right up in front here. We'll pull along the side, and then we'll go check into the office and see if anyone's inside there. All right, Grant. Hey, Buck. Clutch. How you guys doing? Hey, what's going on, man? Good oh. to see you. Where are you, yeah. stranger? I haven't met you yet. <laughs> no kidding. How are you doing, dude? I'm doing swell. How about yourself? I can't complain. This is uh, quite the dealership down here. I have not seen this before. I just happened to be uh, in, in the county, and I heard there was a new dealership. This is amazing down here. Yeah, you know, they had uh, they, they don't have the best dealership. Uh, I think it's called Plateville or something. Down, uh, It's a little south of me. Are you trying to get smacked over there, bud? <laughs> and, uh, they, man... I, I figured, you know, we need a solid John Deere dealership around here. So, oh. that's why we built, yeah, that's why we built uh, Deer Country over here. Well, not Never too mind. Bad. Maybe I might take my business elsewhere, bud. <laughs> well, not too bad. Um, I'm looking actually to pick up something new today. I don't know. It looks like you got a lot of equipment here. Is uh, I'm assuming everything's for sale, right? Everything is for sale. Sweet. Yeah. Sweet. Cool. Well, I'm looking for. Uh, Besides I've, buck. I've been earning a few bucks lately, and uh, it's kind of burning a hole in my pocket right now, to be perfectly honest. I think it's uh, it's time we spend some cash. So I'm hoping uh, you got something I can uh, I can take home today. Yeah. So what are you looking for specifically then? Something big, something okay, really big. Okay. So what do we got are for options? For, so are you looking specifically for tillage then, or for a big grain cart? Because I got we got we got eight R's, which is decently a big tractor. Then we can move all the way up to you know your nine RT, nine R, or even the nine RX. Oh uh, wow, you got everything down here a couple of days ago. Sweet, yeah. you got absolutely everything. Um, you know what? I mean, we're, we're definitely be using some grain carts, uh, but we're also doing, doing some tillage with it as well. So I'm going to need something that's kind of uh, dual purpose. Oh, man. Okay. I, would, I, okay. I don't know if I want to go to a 9RX, though, because then you know what? I'm dealing with all the bearings and everything else that you got to deal with with the uh, the tracks. Oh. How big a grain cart are you pulling? Uh, what's the ones we've got right now? You know what? We're, we're still pretty small. We're only 30,000. What is it? Uh, but you know what? We're definitely going to be increasing size on... Uh, on our farms pretty quickly here so you know i, I don't want to i don't want to limit myself just based on the size of the grain cart we currently have okay okay yeah yeah, yeah. we can uh 
Yeah, it's it's up to you. Here, I'll, I'll have you come take a look at them. As right. far as you're wanting something tracked, so maybe a 9RT, or are you wanting to go... There's tons of different options. Your 9R is probably going to be the cheapest, to be honest, because yep. the tracks are pretty darn expensive. Yeah, exactly. So if you want... Here, we can take a look at the 9R, uh, by all means. I got it over here. Oh, sweet. I do like the 9R. And we can always... We can always put we can always put duels on for you. We could always put so it's a ninety four ten R four hundred ten horse. Uh, she'll get the job done. Four wheel drive, of course. And then you know, say you want big duels on there. We have duels for sale that will come with it. Um, uh, but it'll be good. I'm trying to think for what purpose. I don't mind that. I mean, nope. this would be good for Tillon for sure. Um, and the nice thing about well, where we are. It's pretty hard packed ground, so I don't know if we should go with something that's tracked. I think I'd be just as I don't know. Do you have a nine RX? You said as well. I have a nine RX. Yeah, I want you to take a look at the nine RT though too. Oh so sure, them, you got a nine RT on site? Them, I didn't know that. Let's go take a look. Yeah, yeah, we have a couple nine RTs. They're, they, they're two tracks. They call them two tracks, and then you can go four tracks, which is your nine RX. But the two tracks over here, uh, nine RTs are going to be a little cheaper than your nine RX. Um, let's see, we have one over there. But I think our biggest one is our 9520 RT over here, uh, which is going to be coming in a little more expensive than our 9R, of course. Oh, wow. Uh, but it's, it's a solid tractor. As far as compaction, if you're not looking for compaction, tracks are the way to go on these. I, I don't think I'm really too worried about compaction, to be perfectly honest. Like I said, we got some pretty hard ground where we're at. Um, I don't think I don't think we need to go with this. I think we're... Oh, man. Okay, okay. Okay, well, here, come take a look at the 9RX. We just got this bad boy in. 620 horse. She's got a Kelman's <laughs> engine in her. Oh, yeah, this baby puts her out. 9620 wow. RX. Now, we do have... It's it's a, it's more of a wider stance right now. We can take... We can we can, we can can probably do some adjustments to get a more narrow stance. It's got 30-inch tracks on her. And, man, she's a beast. That's, I don't mind that. I don't know. Wow, that is... Uh... But... It, that is but, amazing, I mean, actually. That is a, a nice honest, looking John Deere. Th this price tag is, you know, you're pushing half a million dollars. Oh, price ouch. Oh, I got to get you exact details, but yeah, it is It is pretty expensive. I want. I just want to be up front with you. We go through That's this. That's a lot of cash. That's for sure. And this one's brand new, you said too, right? Brand new. Maybe that's 0 0.1 hours from unloading and loading off the trailer, but yeah, she's brand new. Brand new. Holy. And do you know, you know how many horsepower this one has? It is uh, 620 horse. <laughs> oh, yeah. God, I think uh, that would do anything I have. I, there's nothing I couldn't do with this, that's for sure. Oh, man. I, yeah. Once again, I'm still locked no. on. Do I do I need to have someone with tracks on it? Like all the extra maintenance I'm going to be dealing with all the bearings and everything in here versus just going with, uh, what was it, just the, the regular 9R, right? I don't know. Yeah, which, which I mean, with maintenance and stuff, I get, we, we have a mechanic, Jimmy. She's great. Uh, she'll get her done for you. If, if, if you need If you need any, like, you know, uh, any servicing, Jimmy's always there. We're going to have a shop truck. We can be out there to do a lot of, like, it, we can get it down to where you don't have to test, t touch this thing besides the steering wheel and uh, the clutch pretty much. Well, well I guess touch. for half a million bucks, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, we have some package, service packages that are real good. Sweet. Well, Buck, what do you think? What, what would you go with? What do you think about this new 9RX? I don't know. 9RX or just a 9R? We got an eight R two. We have an eight R two. I want mainly. I want you to check out this interior on this new eight R, eight R T. I guess. Oh, here, sweet. hop in oh. here. I'll have to take a look at this. Okay. This is uh, the new eight R T. Nice. All right. Yeah, jump in here. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a little bit snug. It's not as snug as I thought it would be. Getting up inside here with both both of us in here. That's not bad. Yeah, yeah. That's why I wanted you to jump in here. But this cab is probably one of my favorite cabs. The nine R X is pretty darn similar. It may be a tad bigger, uh, but this. Uh, yeah, I just want to jump in here. This is uh, <laughs> oh, that's not bad at all. This is a nice looking cab for sure. Oh, Buck! <laughs> yeah, take your seat there, man. <laughs> oh, you're good. Yeah. You sure you're not cramped in there, Clutch? I'm pretty jump sure. Jump on in here, Buck. <laughs> it's not too bad. You know what? There's, there's there? definitely hmm. some room. Too many Big Macs. Think. Oh man, that is uh, that is a sweet piece of machinery. I just don't know if I want to spend a half a million on it. You know, I'm still thinking, like, all I'm going to really need is the 9R, I think, will do do what I'm looking for. But how much is the 9R? Yeah, so our 9R over here is about 380000 I got to get you exact details on it, but it is it's it, it is quite cheaper than 9RX. That just makes a little bit more sense to me right now. I mean, that 9RX is pretty nice, but I don't think I'm quite ready for that yet. And if we can get something that's somewhat close to that for almost half the price, I think um, that might be a better way to go for me, at least for now. Maybe ne next week we'll, we'll discuss something else, but... 
<laughs> I think right now I the nine R looks yeah, pretty good. Yeah. Man, I want I really want you to get some time in that nine R X. Man, you, you could buy you, you buy the nine R right now, and I in this fall, come this fall, if you're on green cart, f- stop on by, and I think we're gonna demo out this nine R X. So oh, that, you can be on the list of demos, and I'd love to get you on it. But man, yeah. that sounds like a great idea. I'd be definitely uh, interested in trying that out. Yeah, for the 9R, I got to run through all the financials. The financial department will do that with you, I guess. Sounds uh, good. But as far as duels, what duels are you going to want honor? Oh, man. Well, um, I think, well, I definitely want to go with some duels. Uh, let's uh, maybe some 900 Firestones. Can we do that? Okay. We have we pair, have a pair in the back. We have a whole set. So uh, that'll work good. Cool. I'm, I'm definitely good. Game. Are you, I'm gonna are jump you willing up. to hold this out today? I, I oh, yeah. I want to take this thing out today, to be honest. I got uh, I got plans. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fire her up, wool and hooker. Let's we'll get going. This thing up. Oh man, nice! I'm excited. This is great. I got the I got the disc detached over here. If you want to pull forward, sweet. All right, let's pull her forward then. Where do you want me to put this up in front of the bays for now? Yeah, let's take a picture. You're my second customer. <laughs> pull on up here. All right, let's get her around here. Oh, this is a little tight. Could could you take our picture quick? Sure. Okay. Okay. I mean, uh, cluster outside. If you if you could just take a picture. All right. I uh, want a certain spot or. Just uh, I think right there's good. I'd say. All right. Three, two, one. Say cheese. 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 Got it. Thanks, Buck. Awesome. Appreciate it. No oh. problem, sir. So uh. What did uh, you end up getting here, uh, Clutch? You get the uh, 9410? 9410, yep. We're going to stay with the RT, or just the uh, 9R instead of going with the RX. Just for now. We'll see. Maybe the fall, things will change for us. But this is uh, going to do me more than what I'm what I'm going to need for for the time being, I think. This is a pretty nice looking tracker. It is. I actually have a 9520R, I believe, on mine. But it has the 900 uh, Michelins instead of... Fo- well, wait. Never mind. You got Michelins on there. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, so I got I got mine, but it's mainly a tillage vehicle. I probably ain't gonna use it much during harvest. Oh, nice, sweet. Well, that's uh, I mean that's a lot of the use we're gonna get out of this. But I'm hoping to uh, maybe get it to pull some carts as well. We'll see what we end up doing with it. But I, I think it's mm-hmm. gonna be multi-purpose. That's for sure. Yeah, definitely, it can be used for a lot of things, except for very tight corners. <laughs> for sure. I mean, yes, articulation helps. A little, a little trickier though. Big fat tires. No, I'm but, um, uh, I'm definitely excited. This is going to be a good uh, a good fall and a good summer for me. I think oh, with this yes. thing, can't wait to get into it. Definitely. Okay, let's get this puppy loaded up. Sweet. Are we uh, well, we got to put those those extra wheels on it, right? Those. Uh, the, oh, that's the right. Duels. That's right. I'll have Jimmy do that quick. Sounds hey, guys. good. Now it's going to be a little wide going down the road, so you got to be careful. Um, obviously, you've trucked all your life, so you know. Yeah, she's uh, she's sticking but, out a little bit on the sides here. That's for sure. I wish we had some ribbon or something we could stick on this, but eh, I'm sure we'll be fine. Yeah, how far are you going? We're going quite a ways, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, we got several hundred miles to put on, so um, you know what? We'll be fine. We'll we'll make do. We'll stop by. Uh, we got a logistics center just up on the north side there. I'll stop by there and we'll take care of it and make sure everything's uh, kosher and then head out from there. But uh, it'll be an interesting drive even to get to the other side of the county. That's for sure. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. All the uh, if you want to back up, I'll back you up over here. Yeah. Sounds good. Let's up. go uh, fire this thing. I like thing those up. mud flaps, Clutch. You like those? Yeah. <laughs> that looks sweet. <laughs> Yeah, we got a couple of these uh, these Peterbilts back at the logistics center, and uh, the, the boys have been kind of making up their own. Let's put it that way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's hook this thing up. There we go. All right, perfect. Well, I think uh, I think I'm good to go, man. Thank you so much for the deal. I appreciate that, and uh, I'll be speaking with you later on this fall. That's for sure. This is uh, this is pretty cool. Yeah, I appreciate the business. No problem. It's, great. it's a, To be it's, honest, you're the second customer here, and man, you're the best customer. <laughs> well, you know what? I think you're going to get quite a few more. This is a nice looking dealership you got going on here, man. So uh, we'll definitely be back. Okay. We'll see you later, Clutch. All right. See you, buddy. I was third. All right. What a deal. Not bad. Let's get out of here. We're going to head out and... Uh, yeah, we're nice. We're gonna take this out to back to Hazard County, guys. This is where this truck, this tractor is heading to Hazard County. This is gonna be a sweet tractor to have out on the farm there. I can't wait. All right, guys, we're back on Hazard County. As you can see, we made it all the way back down to our farm. 
I managed to put some oversized load stickers because, well, this is kind of ridiculous, <laughs> just to say the least. Um, I'm looking forward to having this on the farm, but to be perfectly honest, guys, I don't really have a use for this yet. Ah, man. You know what? We could do some cultivating with it, maybe, but everything... I mean, we only have a small cultivator still, and uh, I really don't need to uh, to go to town with that quite yet. I think that, you know, like all the tractors we have can handle that. The case can handle that cultivator I have. I need to buy another one where, well, I spent a lot of money. We still have a lot of uh, brown water we can sell off to make some more, I'm sure. But, oh man, I don't have a lot of things I can do with this yet. I kind of want to, I want to test it out. I want to play with this thing. Oh man, I don't know yet. It does look good in here though. Look at this, look at all, oh, Whammer's got a bunch of sheep out there as well. Actually, you know what? We've got Whammer's farm right here. Um, I wonder if he's around. Let's, uh, let's go check in in. I want to show him this tractor anyways. We'll go in for a drive-by and see if maybe we can catch him doing something. Uh, maybe he's hanging out and we can say hi to him. All right, let's see if we can find Whammer down here somewhere. Uh, let's see, what would be the best spot? Maybe down below? I don't see anything up at the main house here. Nothing down on the main side. We'll go down the bottom here. Let's see if we can... Oh, I think I saw him. I think I just saw him. Let's just pull in on the bottom here. He's got to see this tractor. Oh, that's a tight turn. Holy... <laughs> Hope I can get out of here afterwards. All right, let's just pull in here. See if he's in his shop or where the heck he's hanging out. Hey, Wem, are you in there? Yeah, clutch. Hey, dude, what are you doing? I got something to show you, man. I uh, I might have picked something up. I might have splurged a little bit, dude. Um, yeah, we what picked up we picked up a new John Deere. Uh, we went a little bit crazy today, and uh, the new nine RT. We managed to pick this oh, thing up. Holy, <laughs> that thing is huge yeah we we kind of went a little bit crazy i felt well you know what i've been making a little bit of money as you're more than well aware i'm sure but uh, i decided to kind of go nuts um i'm hoping you know what i got nothing i need this for right yet but i kind of want to take it for a test drive any chance you got anything that needs like cultivating or some wagons and towed around or anything like that well you know i just bought a field and uh unfortunately when i bought it it had a crop on it that, that kind of withered on me so um I need to get that cultivated at some point. Um, oh, that sounds like a good my, dude, my dudes is actually in the shop right now. He's just working on it. So maybe you could uh, give it a shot on that field. Oh, I'd, I'd love to do that. You got a cultivator I could borrow? It looks like there's something in the back over there. I could probably grab. I'm sure yeah. I could grab that. Yeah, that there's one right over here. Oh, sweet. All right. So let me get uh, let me get this trailer disconnected. I'm going to get this tractor off here, and uh, this is going to be fun. All right. Let's fire this thing up again. Oh, man. Love it. All right, let's uh, get this thing rocking and rolling. I'm excited to use this, guys. I mean, it's nice you can actually help somebody out, too, which is even better. So uh, we're just going to go grab this cultivator he's got back here. It looks like it's a big, what is that, a five row? Or a, uh, a five uh, panel? Yeah, it looks fairly good size. All right, let's grab that. And uh, then we'll go over and see if I can, I don't even know which field he, he needs me to help him out with. Let me just connect to this thing right here. All right, how's that look, how's that look? That uh, looks pretty good. Awesome. All right, so let's go over. I'm going to go find him back in the shop there and see what field he needs me to take care of. Hey, Whammer, which uh, which field did you need me to take care of again? I know you said there was a field that had some withered crops on it. Which one was it? Yeah, it's just uh, over to the west. Um, if you go down here to the where the way you came in and uh, take a right and go across the creek and just head straight down, you'll run right into it. All right, roger that. Through the creek and then straight down, I'll run right into it. Perfect. Awesome. Cool. Yep. I mean, uh, I'm going to go have some fun in your fields, dude. Thanks a lot for uh, giving me a chance to do that. I appreciate that. <laughs> Hey, thanks for the, the free work. Hey, no problem. Anytime. All right, let's go. Go, 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 go. All right, so down to the left and then through the creek. So there we go. And there's the creek, of course. Oh, this looks pretty deep. <laughs> well, it looks like I'm not the first person to go through it. And, uh, well, I'm sure of all tractors, this thing can handle a little bit of a water. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Look at that. Nice. All right. Come on out nice and easy. Bring that that uh, plow through it with us. Nice. All right, let's rock and roll all the way to the end. He said, and we'll run right on into it. So I certainly feel like we're going to be putting all what is it, 620 horsepower of this John Deere to the test with this uh, cultivator. What a good test right off the shoot here. I love this. This is fantastic. Looks like he's been doing a little bit of uh, a little bit of hand going on here as well. Let's get to the top of this hill. Oh man, look at fall in the county. It looks good up here. And he's got some crops still growing here. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Yeah, we've got a crop right ahead of us. That's perfect. So it looks like we've uh, we've got a little bit of work ahead of us. Actually, that's a pretty good-sized crop he's got us to take care of. Uh, I wonder how much he paid for that field. All right, let's drop on in. Let's see here. You know what? I don't care where we go into this. 
open this thing up. Oh man, this is a big cultivator. Holy. Yeah, this thing is, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, it's seven, it's seven panels. Um, this is going to be even a struggle for this. Drop her in. Oh, man. Oh, it looks good, guys. It looks so good. All right. Well, we're going to need to buy some better uh, cultivating equipment for our farm, that is for sure. But uh, this ain't bad. We'll help Whammer out today. Use a little, bit, uh, a little bit of work for ourselves. Get some use out of our new tractor. I'm liking it. Not bad. Cool. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for us today. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. And, of course, drop a like if you enjoyed and of course, don't forget to subscribe and like to any of the other ones that were involved with this video today. You'll find links to all that everyone else's channel in the description below, as always. Anyways, guys, hope you have a great day, and I will catch you next time. This is Clutch, over and out.